Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying 12. 12 of these little tiny cupcakes. They are called Baked by Melissa. These were given to us from Dan and Connie in New York, and Baked by Melissa is located in New York. And I'm gonna be giving you a lot of information about them, especially towards the end of the video. Uh, but I wanna show you, you're gonna see pictures of how these actually came at the end of the video. We, we needed to do this video differently so that I could get good pictures and make sure that this is- had every flavor. This, they came in these trays. And they were wrapped in plastic. Yes, wrapped in plastic, so they were completely sealed. Uh, but they came in this box, which is an awesome tie-dye. I mean, I can keep this box forever and ever. Um, but the- flavors that are in this collection. I'm gonna let Kevin give you the Are you gonna say all the flavors? Well, yeah, because the, they're all marked. Okay, so we've got rainbow cookie, chocolate electric tie-dye, s'mores, um, deconstructed cookie dough. I wrote them. <laughs> um, cookie dough, chocolate chip pancake, um, cookies and cream, red velvet, triple chocolate fudge, mint cookie, peanut butter and jelly, and tie-dye. So I think when we do try them, I think that we should try to do the two cookie dough ones together cool. so that we can see if they taste alike. Can you do this one? These, uh, so then they had around these, uh, wrapped in plastic, they had these bands. And you so, can grab it and pull one out of the box that way. But this is a place that you uh, can visit in New York. You can also order them online, but which I'll tell you about in a little bit. Uh, but you can visit them in New York. And so uh, uh, Connie went there um, and she ordered these for us. She paid um, 74, it, was, it says, she got a $4 discount. It was $70 total because it was a choose your own cupcake. So she got 50 cupcakes for $70. I don't think that's bad for 50, uh, for 50 cupcakes, but I have looked at their website and they're different prices. So there's all different price points. I think she said if you go in, you can get them for a dollar a piece. Um, but but they're all different prices. That's just what she paid, I think, because she got to choose her own. So we're gonna go through these. They're 47 calories per cupcake. Oh, that one first. That one's the cookie dough. This one's the cookie dough. And let me tell you, they, they are cute little things. We are going to half them. And do you want it off the... Super fresh. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's good. Mm, it's very, very good. It's like, um, it's like you've taken just one little bite of cake. <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah. But it's very, very good. It has but, a very good um, flavor to it. Uh, the chocolate. You mm -hmm. really taste, you it taste like, chocolate. and there's a grittiness to it where it has a lot of sugar in it. Uh, that one's delicious. Okay. You want... Absolutely delicious. And what, that one was cookie dough? That one was cookie dough. Now you want that one, which I'm pretty sure is that one. Yes. And what is this one called? This is deconstructed cookie dough. Oh, okay. Okay. <clears throat> Can you pick yours? Yeah. Okay. I should have brought two napkins. So well. That one tastes like raw chocolate chip cookie dough. But which one do you I like? I like the first one better. I do too. <laughs> the first one. Yeah, and the first this one is right just dough. called cookie dough. Yeah. I like the, the cookie dough more than the deconstructed because I do like the little, um, uh, it had like mini chocolate chips <clears> on top. <throat> I like that. But um, at the same time, it took away from the first one, which was just a lot sweeter, right. and you just tasted more pure chocolate. Yeah, I agree. Um, still delicious though. I okay. tried the the one this one. This one? Yeah, that one's called Rainbow Cookie. And it is so they're so pretty on the bottom. Okay. Ooh, this has something in the middle. Oh yeah, it's got like a jelly or something. Oh my goodness. Oh, 
That is raspberry. Good, uh, yeah, it's a raspberry flavor. Mm, that's good. So it makes sense why these are so expensive because they're spending time doing each one of these little things, decorating them, filling them. That is it raspberry or is it cherry? I mean, it's not a super strong flavor. Um, it could be raspberry, but it could, I don't know. I don't, I don't, truly, I don't know. Because, well, now that I've chewed more of it, I feel like it uh, It reminds me of a, a cherry flavor. Mm -hmm. It's some kind of berry It's like hard, it. yeah, it's hard to tell. We're eating half of these. They are 47 calories each, and since we're doing the whole review in one go, we're only eating half of it. Right. Now, rest assured that, <laughs> that we're going to eat a whole one, you know, after. Oh, yeah. Yeah, do that one. That one's just tie-dye, is what it says. Because normally we would eat a whole one, but we also wouldn't eat 12 at a time. Right, you know? yeah, you're only going to eat a few at a time. But that's why we're having it. The colors are so pretty. Mm -hmm. Very vibrant colors. Mm, that's good. It has a that one had a like a nutty flavor. That is nice. I'm wondering if how the dyes on that affected you. No, Did, you no, didn't taste it at all. all. No, it didn't get any bitterness from it at least. What was the one called right before that? I know I'm quizzing you. Um. Not deconstructed. No. Because because I really, Rainbow cookie. Rainbow cookie. I really I didn't comment on it much. I really did like the flavor of that. Um, I like it that it had that berry in the center. Uh, because it was just a burst of, of a different flavor. It was, it was delicious. I agree. Okay. I'm, I'm gonna get the warmth off of this um, this layer. So we want that one next. This one? That's the chocolate electric tie-dye. Okay. That reminds me a lot, honestly, of the second one we tried. Mm -hmm. The deconstructed. Yeah. It reminds me a lot of that. And now it doesn't have the texture, the, the little chocolate chips, but the flavor reminds me is the very, same. Very good, very sweet. Yes. I love how fresh these are. I do too. They're very, very moist and fresh. Mm -hmm. And they do ship these. They ship these worldwide. So. Yeah, they're in a cool little like bubble pack, so they don't go anywhere. Yes. It's pretty cool. And the one with the marshmallow. This s'mores. Is s'mores. So that's all for that layer. Okay. Go ahead. Yep. Oh no, your marshmallow fell off. Okay. Mm, that marshmallow is soft. The very soft marshmallow. That had a cinnamon in it. Mm -hmm. It does have cinnamon. Yeah, it said it was s'mores, but it has it definitely has cinnamon. Yeah, in it. I, I didn't really get. I wonder if that's the graham flavor that we're going for. Uh, I, I don't flavor. know, but it did. It didn't remind me of. It's delicious, but it didn't remind me of s'mores because it had cinnamon. And I'm not used of, to cinnamon in my s'mores. I can kind of see the cinnamon being like the graham cracker kind of flavor. Mm -hmm. um, I didn't really get the marshmallow flavor, but I got the chocolate and that cinnamon kind but of But the flavor. marshmallow was incredibly it soft. Was. Um, why don't you do uh, cookie? Did we do cookies and cream already? No, that's the one with the big cookie on. Yeah, we definitely have enough of And I'm, I, I don't know if we'll... Oh, okay. Yeah, it's soft. I was worried that the cookie would be... Like Oreo. ...too crisp. It does have a center mm -hmm. in it. Yeah, it's filled. Mmm. That's really, really good. That's delicious. <clears throat> that tastes like, just like you've made an Oreo cake, uh, mm -hmm. cookies and cream cake. Like when you've, when you've taken it and it's gotten the soft batter and you've made it, that's what that reminds yeah, it's me of. Very, very, very it's good. delicious cookies and cream. Oh. And that cookie was soft. It wasn't crispy. It wasn't hard, which well, isn't bad. Why don't you do that one? That's red velvet. I like the little sugar crystals on top. That's nice. Mm -hmm. It has a red velvet flavor. It has that almost like cream cheese flavor. I was going to say, it doesn't remind me. It's good. It's sweet. But it doesn't necessarily remind me of... Uh, Cream cheese. The, it's the the chocolate in there reminds you of the red velvet chocolate. Yes, 
but it's very nice. All of these have been super, super moist. Yeah, it, it is missing the cream cheese flavor. Mm -hmm. What we have for red velvet is super cream cheesy. So yes, yeah. yes, but it's still delicious. Oh yeah. Um, do you want to do the chocolate chip pancakes? Yes. That's that one. Yeah, chocolate chip pancake. Let me wipe this knife off. I'm saving the peanut butter and jelly for last, by the way. Ah, uh, I wondered. <laughs> Yeah, they said they know how much we like peanut butter, so they put more peanut butter and jelly in there. In that one? Mm hmm That's good. I like that one. That was very sweet. I was expecting a maple flavor in there because it was pancake, but it, but it didn't. But it's really just chocolate chip. Mm -hmm. But I like it because my piece, at least, had like extra chocolate chips. Yeah, I got extra. I got chocolate chips. So, chip. yeah, so they were so plentiful that there was no denying that that was chocolate chip. Okay, do we got triple chocolate mint and the peanut butter and jelly. Do you want to go ahead and do the peanut butter and jelly? Yeah, let's do peanut butter and jelly. You don't want to. Go ahead. You don't want to have double chocolate mint. Yeah, they, these are filled. Yeah. You immediately get peanut butter. Hmm. I like the jelly flavor too. Isn't that crazy how strong that is? Mm -hmm. That's good. That's that peanut butter is probably the strongest flavor that we've had in here. Um. Uh, yeah. I mean, the chocolate's pretty as far good as strong, one flavor yeah. being really, really strong. Except the cinnamon in the in the, the cinnamon s'mores. and the s'mores was strong, but that peanut butter is very. It's just like a sweet, creamy peanut butter. But I like the jelly too. Mm -hmm. That uh, that it's That's amazing really how well that works. And you can do triple chocolate or the triple yeah. chocolate. And then what's the last one? Mint. Mint cookie. Mint cookie. So we'll do mint cookie last. Do you want that one? Awesome chip. Mm. Now that one has a strong, darker chocolate flavor. It's good. It but tastes it like a dark chocolate, chocolate cake, mm -hmm. a rich chocolate cake. Yeah. I'll, I'll Not love Devil's that. Food Cake, which is bitter. This has no, a it's just a richer chocolate. Yes, it's just a nice dark chocolate cake. Andrew would like that. Mm, it's very, very nice. Andrew nice. really likes uh, dark chocolate cake. And mint. Mm. You get the mint. Yeah. We both went mm, at yeah. the same time. Yeah, you really get that mint flavor. No, because you get a burst of mint, and uh, that was a good one to end on mm -hmm. because it's almost like it's fresh and like yeah, fresh it's, flavor. It's, it's not toothpasty, but it is fresh. Mm -hmm. I think these are all good. I do have to admit, some of them very, tasted very similar to each other, it's, like the tie dye ones. Kind of all tasted the same, right? Uh, somewhat. But yeah. some of them had, like, you would get one tie dye that had a chocolate frosting and one tie dye that would have a vanilla. Yeah, so frosting. they're slightly different, but they're yes. very similar. Right. Other, what I mean, they're the, not like the dead on the exact cake, same thing. The base cake is yeah. the same flavor. I think these are excellent quality, though. The, oh, I do too. The um, difference you, comes in the top. Can you imagine if you had a, a get together and you took all these out and put them on a plate? If well, you could just grab the ones they thought were cool looking. <laughs> they, they, you said that they have, let me, I have cheat sheets here because I visited their website, like I said. They have um, corporate gifts and events. They have a section. If you go to their website, you need to go. I'm going to link below to their website. And they have a special section called um, the Flavor Hall of Fame. And these are ones that they have made in the past. And it's kind of like going to the Ben and Jerry's graveyard. Right. But it's so cool because they have pictures and names of all the ones they've had in the past. Of course, you they're, can't get them anymore, right? Well, there are 57 of them. And they have flavors. Well, I'm not going to name them all. But they have flavors of, of cupcakes like pink frosted donut, strawberry cheesecake, candy cane, Caramel hot chocolate, uh, chocolate babka, yeah, there chocolate was caramel ones in here. carrot cake. Um, so what the deal is, is the Hall of Fame donuts are available as custom orders uh, of 300 or more. So, so if you're getting a large gathering. If you have a large gathering, oh, this would be awesome. Can you imagine, like some people throw special uh, 
uh, 13th birthday, 16th birthday, and have these available, kids would go wild over these. But I mean, adults would too, if you're having like a wedding or something like that. But they had the, it, the Hall of Fame, I enjoyed looking at it because there's like a special section, like they have like a Cookie Monster and an Elmo or Big Bird. And I mean, they just have some really cool ones on there. Um, but these boxes, they have these special boxes. They make them that say, uh, birthday, baby, thank you, thinking of you, wedding, engagement. And my favorite is because it's Ashley saying. Ashley has this saying that she uses all the time. They actually had one of these that have this saying. It says, you're doing great. And I thought that would be perfect for Ashley. You're doing great because she has actually told people that and uh, many, many times you're doing great. Something so, sarcastic. Um, <laughs> usually she means it though. Um, but they have limited edition flavors and they have seasonal flavors. So you can go to their website right now and it's going to be a little different than it will be like in a couple months time. Um, they have gluten-free cupcakes. Mm. Gluten-free, as of right now, they're offering tie-dye, triple chocolate crunch, red velvet, caramel, uh, cinnamon, birthday cake. They have vegan, so if you're vegan, they have peanut butter, chocolate vanilla chip, strawberry, and triple chocolate chip. And then the vegan limited edition, they have uh, chocolate coconut and cinnamon bun. Uh, so there's something for everybody. Mm -hmm. If you have a special diet, they have it for you. They also sell not just uh, cupcakes, but they sell macarons. So they have sugar cookie, double chocolate, red velvet, cookie dough, snickerdoodle, and salted caramel. And some people love so, macarons. Those are okay for me. Sometimes. They're okay. Yeah, yeah, it's like we've tried a lot of them, and it's like they're okay. We like ultra sweet things. So yeah. If we're gonna have a dessert, we want I like the texture of them. Though. Really, yeah, I like the, the yes, the texture, the, the really textures nice. unbeatable of a macaron. Um, but now these are wonderful. They're very, very and like nice. I said, they have different price points. And and you can tell the level of quality they put in, time and effort mm -hmm. they put into it, just for them to to make these and then fill them. And they're very highly decorated. I mean, they're not like a birthday, I mean, a huge wedding cake decorated, but they are each individually decorated mm -hmm. um, uh, cupcake. So that takes time and, and makes sense why they're, right. why they're expensive. Yes. So they have a nationwide shipping and they're guaranteed fresh. And so, like I said, and if you order from them, we don't know anything yeah, about Yeah, I won't know about it. I'm just, uh, Dan and Connie gave these to us and, um, we had never heard of them before. So I'm sure if you're a New Yorker, you have probably heard of these and you can tell us or which ones you've tried. It would be cool to live in the area and then every time they came out with a new like seasonal flavor to go in and get that. Um, that would be really neat. Uh, but yeah, please let us know if you've had them before. Check out their website. I'll, like I said, I'll link below. Thank you very, very much to Dan and Connie. Uh, this was a very, very special gift. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.